The Sami Monastery or Sami Gompa is the first Buddhist monastery built in Tibet. It was most probably first constructed between 775 and 779 CE under the patronage of King Trisong Detson of Tibet who sought to revitalize Buddhism, which had declined since its introduction by King Tsongtsen Gampo in the 7th century. The monastery is in Drainang, Shanam Prefecture. It was supposedly modeled on the design of Odam Taparai Monastery in what is now Bihar, India. The 18th century Punning Temple of Shingda, Hebei, China was modeled after the Sami Gompa. History According to tradition, the Indian monk Shantarakshita made the first attempt to construct the monastery while promoting his sutra centric version of Buddhism. Finding the Sami site auspicious, he set about to build a structure there. However, the building would always collapse after reaching a certain stage. Terrified, the construction workers believed that there was a demon or obstructive thought form in a nearby river making trouble. When Shantarakshita's contemporary Padmasambhava arrived from northern India, he was able to subdue the energetic problems obstructing the building of Sami. According to the fifth Dalai Lama, Padmasambhava performed the Varakilaya dance and enacted the rite of thread cross or Namkor to assist King Trisong Dutsen and Shantarakshi to clear away obscurations and hindrances in the building of Sami. The great religious master Padmasambhava performed this dance in order to prepare the ground for the Sami monastery and to pacify the malice of the La, local mountain god spirits and Srin malevolent spirits in order to create the most perfect conditions. He went on to say that after Padmasambhava consecrated the ground he erected a thread cross a euro a web colored thread woven around two sticks a euro to catch evil. Then the purifying energy of his dance forced the malevolent spirits into a skull mounted on top of a pyramid of dough. His tantric dance cleared away all the obstacles, enabling the monastery to be built in 767. The dance was memorialized by construction of Varakilaya Stupas a Euro monuments honoring the ritual Kilaya daggers a Euro at the cardinal points of the monastery, where they would prevent demonic forces from entering the sacred grounds. The above mentioned quotation makes reference to the relationship of the Varakilaya Ferba to the stupa and mentions Torma and Namkor. Moreover, the building of Sami marked the foundation of the original school of Tibetan Buddhism, the Nyingma. This helps explain how Padmasambhava's tantric centric version of Buddhism gained ascendance over the sutra based teaching of Shantarakshita. Perlman succinctly charts the origin of the institution of the Nishang Oracle. When Padmasambhava consecrated Sami Monastery with a Varakilaya dance, he tamed the local spirit protector, Vihal Gilpo, and bound him by oath to become the head of the entire hierarchy of Buddhist protective spirits. Vihal, later known as Dorji Drogdon, became the principal protector of the Dalai Lamas, manifesting through the Nishang Oracle. The original buildings have long disappeared. They have been badly damaged several times a euro by civil war in the 11th century, fires in the mid-17th century and in 1826, an earthquake in 1816, and in the 20th century, particularly during the Cultural Revolution. As late as the late 1980s pigs and other farm animals were allowed to wander through the sacred buildings. Each time it has been rebuilt, and today, largely due to the efforts of the 10th Pankan Lama from 1986 onward, it is again an active monastery and important pilgrimage and tourist destination. Debate at Samyur the Council of Lhasa Adamk provides a circa five-year range when Mayan and Kamalashila may have debated at Samyur in Tibet. As is well known, the fate of Chan, East Mountain teachings in Tibet was said to have been decided in a debate at the Samyur Monastery near Lhasa in C792-797. Broughton identifies the Chinese and Tibetan nomenclature of Mohuan's teachings and identifies them principally with the East Mountain teachings. Moho Yen's teaching in Tibet as the famed proponent of the all at once gate can be summarized as gazing at mind, and no examining, or no thought no examining. Gazing at mind is an original northern teaching. As will become clear, Po Tang and the northern can dovetail in the Tibetan sources. Moho Yen's teaching seems typical of late northern Khan. Moho Yen arrived on the central Tibetan scene somewhat late in comparison to the Khan transmissions from Sichuan. Gallery. The monastery, Sami Monastery is laid out on the shape of a giant mandala, 
with the main temple representing the legendary Mount Meru in the center. Other buildings stand at the corners and cardinal points of the main temple, representing continents and other features of Tantric Buddhist cosmology. The main temple is full of Tibetan religious art in mural and statue forms, as well as some important relics. Many Tibetan Buddhists come on pilgrimage to Sam, some taking weeks to make the journey. See also, Moho Yen, Cham Dance, Notes. References, Dorji, Gyan Footprint Tibet Handbook with Bhutan. Second edition. Footprint Handbooks Limited. ISBN 0 8442 2190 2. Dalman, Keith. The Power Places of Central Tibet. Routledge and Kegan Paul. London and New York. ISBN 0 7102 1370 0. Rene Danubeski Wojewicz, Tibetan Religious Dances, Yesh Tsogil, The Life and Liberation of Padmasam Bhava, 2 vols, trans. Kenneth Douglas and Gwendolyn Bays, Perlman, Ellen. Tibetan Sacred Dance, A Journey into the Religious and Folk Traditions. Rochester, Vermont, USA, Inner Traditions. ISBN 0-89281-918-9, Luke Wagner and Ben Deitel. Samuel Copyright, External Links, Sami Monastery, Sacred Destinations, Sami, by Travel China Guide.